that stuff right now. When you're out of knives, refill your stock by returning to Messiah. Oh great, now the wire is messing up on me. Pass your weapons around so carelessly. You won't often get a second chance to strike. You can use stealth kills to create a distraction by throwing a knife, pushing somebody up. Rafiq. Word has spread of your deeds, Altair. It seems you are sincere in your desire to redeem yourself. I do what I can. And sometimes you do it well. I assume it is work that reunites us? Yes. William of Montferrat is my target. What can you tell me of the man himself? William has been named regent while the king conducts his war. The people see it as a strange choice given the history between Richard and William's son, Conrad. But I think Richard rather clever for it. Clever how? Richard and Conrad do not see eye to eye on most matters. Though they are civil enough in public, there are whispers that each intends evil upon the other. And then, there was that business with Akar's captured Saracens. In its wake, Conrad has returned to Tyre, and Richard has compelled William to remain here as his guest. You mean his hostage? Whatever you wish to call it, William's presence here should dissuade Conrad from acting out. I've never been one for politics. But surely you realize your every action shapes the course of this land's future. You are a politician too, in your own way. As you wish. Now where would you suggest I begin my search? Richard's citadel, southwest of here. Or rather, the market in front of it. You'll find the Cathedral of the Holy Cross in that direction as well. 
It's a popular place and should be filled with talkative citizens. Finally, try the border to the west, where the chain and hospitaler districts meet. That should start you on your way. Very well. I won't disturb you further. It's no trouble at all. Sound, buddy. Don't think it's You always want that part in your life where you want peace, right? You all want peace. Part of it, right? But. When it comes to your life, there's that part that. You dare steal in my presence! You don't cost you your have life. peace. And, uh. Sometimes things happen. When is he gonna stop this nonsense? Uh, supposed to happen. So, when it comes to those kind of things, you have to elaborate. Those, you have um, people in your life 
that you feel were there to support you, right? You have people in your life that you feel were supposed to be there for you, supposed to push you, help you, support you, and all that, right? And there is a girl that I knew with the name of Kelsey. Okay. You dirty thief! I'll have your hands for that. Please help me, anyone. Thief! This will teach you nothing. I beg of you, you dirty, dirty you thief! Oh, no. I'll have your hands for no. that. Please don't leave me. So when it comes to people like that, they got you involved with. They got you involved with um, church and doing all these great things for you. They're supposed to be there for you, and then one day they just choose to just rub things in your face. You've done nothing wrong, you've supported them, you've helped them, you've encouraged mm. them, you've done everything your your part to be a good friend. But then they backstab you. Well that's kinda where it kinda started. Die, and as I progressed on with more and more people that I knew, I started getting more and more disappointed because of matters that I, I, I couldn't trust. What now, wouldn't it be funny and if he hurt him? Kelsey was really, really, she was a friend that I do not want to, let's just say that I went a long way with Kelsey, because she was always somebody that would encourage me to go to church, encourage me to pay attention to the things around me about Jesus and the Bible and whatnot, in terms of stuff. So... It's a difficult thing to deal with something like that. Also, you know, sometimes in your life you may feel like uh, lonely, right? We get that sometimes. And a lot of people was asking me about that. Uh, I know a lot of you are concerned. And trust me, I know it's a battle. I'm getting through it, Dream Team. All my fans out there have been showing me moral support to this for all these years. I appreciate you. And I love you for that. Um, it's really tough to get through something that is traumatic. And, um, a lot of you were asking why I was off Twitch for so long, why I stopped posting, why I stopped getting up all social media, why I stopped doing rap music so much. It's because of the trauma, man. It's just all the drama and all that stuff. And uh, it's never easy to be a part of something when uh, you constantly have to deal with problems. <laughs> So, that's what I really wanted to just kind of say to you. Um, hold on, let me, uh, I gotta get on a seat. All right, then. Where are you? Hold on. Too sure what happened here. I started to be off guard there, so I gotta pick. I gotta pick. They let guy. you come and go as you please. I thought the fortress was close to all. Aye, but William wishes to have repairs completed as soon as possible. It's been to our advantage. The perfect cover. It's clever. Anyway, I finished my report and should deliver it. For once, it seems things might go our way, and not by accident. Well, the Bible does say God helps those who help themselves. Nah, it doesn't actually. That's from one of Aesop's fables. The Bible says right, quite so the opposite, in fact. Pickpocket this Many guy. passages of being patient and faithful, and waiting for the Lord to decide if he wishes to assist. 
I'll All I say, we've Hollow waited Earth. long enough. You'll hear no argument from me. Very well. I'm off then. It's things like that that um, I'm trying to get out of here. Hold on, I'm trying to see the best way to get out of here. I could climb and get out, but uh, they're like right on me. So. Damn. Where is the heathen responsible for this? Hold on, let me see. Um. Let's get out of here. You're not supposed to be here. Leave. You are not allowed to be here. Leave. Shut up. Always oh, gotta look at my surroundings. Sorry, I'm just trying to focus here. Get through this. I want to get through this game. Yeah, I really do. There's another viewpoint here. I'll have your hands for that. It's my fifth day on this game. But as I was saying before, forbidden for you to be here. I'll have your hands for that. You dirty thief. I'll have your hands for that. Anyone. One thing I'm really trying to focus on as hard as I can. Uh, you know, I had a lot of good memories on Twitch, right? He should stop but then again, I had bad memories as well, and uh, I want to forget that. You know, I want to forget the past. I want to forget the things that hurt me the most. Pain is the number one thing that I've been facing. It's something that I've been dealing with. And, uh, Leave, peasant. Oh, it's so good being able to elaborate, talk about. You have no business here. Leave. that uh, there's a lot of things in my life I didn't learn you know the things that my mother was supposed to teach me and show me she didn't and because of that you know I was behind you know the greatest thing that could have ever happen for me was the day when I had thousands of kids lined up at the school wanting my autograph wanting pictures wanting all of these things and um, that was something that uh made my day when they were telling me you're gonna make it they're buying my merch you know they're wanting autographs and a whole entire school bus was singing my song was rapping my lyrics and that was like the greatest moment I will never forget you know I mean but it hurts so much to know the next two weeks everyone was saying I was falling off people were leaving betraying me all this stuff had happened and that hurt me the most. Please, do what something. the hell do you want? And you dare steal in my presence? You know, I had a. Double cost you your life. I had a a, a group of people, Move. very evil people, that contacted me and told me that they would take away the synod too. And uh, that's what happened. That's exactly what happened. Something really weird happened. Within the next day, I'd say a few days, something very strange happened. That. I was just 
did not make any sense to me at all because the way that it happened, it, it was just no explanation except something like conspiracy, now, whatever you want to call it. He hurt himself? And my entire community just betrayed me. Like, everyone was going against me. I had a fan that was like saying he wanted to worship the devil and all this stuff and I'm like what the heck is going on you're somewhere you so be. Leave before you get hurt. that's kind of where things really went down south for me you know I, I love rap you know it's it's in my nature you know it's just not part of who I am you know it's my passion and I love it but when you do something for so long and create that skill to show people what you're capable of. You want people to continue to feel that you are your own person. You know, you're creative in your own ways. And you don't care what anybody thinks. So it's things like that that I'm still trying to get a hump over, uh, feeling lonely, things like that. Um, I've learned that my expectations, I, I put them too high on myself. That's a problem with me, like, especially with no damage runs. Like, I'm so hard on myself. Like, I'm my hardest critic. And I know I sometimes, like, I, I'm like this towards the people I love, you know, uh, girl, things like that. And it, it's one thing that I don't see. It's something that I've been trying to pay more attention to. Lunatic. That's exactly what he is. But um, I just want to get through this hard chapter. I just want to get through this hard chapter. And um, uh, looks like I got another mission here. It's an informer challenge. Oh God! Don't kill me! Oh, it's you, Altair. You scared me. Richard's men are after me. Two of them, to be exact. I was trying to strike a deal with them, but I realized that they were toying with me, so I ran away. You shall be the angel of death and collect their heads before they collect mine. When it is done, I shall tell you of the deal. So it looks like I have to go after these two people and kill them, which is pretty common with this game. There's always some kind of assassination going on. That's just my second wave. Um, but, uh... Like I said, um, dude, which one is it? Yeah, it's this guy here. What happened here? Just give me a sec, I got one more to go here. I think another thing that's been going on with me as well, that people have been concerned about when I was talking, is you see, it it was the coolest thing for me to know that that um when I used to freestyle on Twitch, you know, I just used to game and stuff for fun. And then one day, I just randomly was like freestyling while gaming, and people liked it. And I'll never forget his name. His name was Ablizio. And if I remember, he donated to me like a thousand dollars in a matter of like two minutes. And he just told me I'm fire. Like, you know, my my lyrics were fire, my bars were fire, and all that cool stuff. And um, and that's when I really discovered that I could freaking I could rap. I'm. Not to be cocky, I'm, I'm just saying I know I can rap because I learned from the best and I was criticized pretty hard from a really good friend of mine that's, that is like a brother to me. Get out of the way, stupid woman. Move. Get out of the way. Stupid. The lunatic's getting in the way. Move. There. What a relief it is to know that I am safe. Thank you, Master. So I 
tried to make a deal with the Citadel when guards I used to leave the gates on open, Twitch, even when the alarm sounds. I was starting to get my name out there. I was really getting so now, big, your only and then I was starting to go Richard's viral Citadel will over be to a climb video the I did. Walls. And it was Forgive me. so embarrassing. But I did this video. Um, so somebody was like recorded me. I guess they, I did the video on Twitch, and they, they just took the video and then they, they put it out there and it blew up. And then I got off Twitch for like four years. I've had to change my name and everything because people were calling me Fart Boy and all this other stuff. So this is like what I'm dealing with, you know. And I'm trying my hardest to just forget it. I'm trying my hardest to forget the times. Of pain and, and, and people laughing at me and stuff like that you know it, it shouldn't matter what people have to say about you and that's when I'm, I'm, I'm learning you know learning after my family I'm learning after my girlfriend I'm learning after the people that care so much about me love me and um, the number one thing I hate that bothers me the most is being seen as the bad guy like that feeling is the worst feeling you can ever have and that's how I've been feeling I've been feeling like you know, I'm being seen as the bad guy and it sucks it really sucks to be seen in that kind of light or that darkness where you know that you're a good person and people see you in this bad light like you're the bad guy when you when you're really not when you've done nothing wrong you know people make mistakes but you don't want to be seen that way and uh that's what I'm dealing with right now. So, so bear in mind that, yeah, I'm doing everything I can. This will teach you not to steal. What have I done wrong? Tell me, please. Thief. This will teach you not to steal. Stop it, please. You're hurting. Hold on. Let me synchronize. But don't don't worry. Um, I'm gonna be talking to somebody. I'm gonna be getting some help. That's why I'm streaming right now, so I can vent, so I can be myself. I think at times I forget who I am. I think that's the biggest problem because of the events that's gone on in my life and who I am and what I do. I think because of that. Sometimes I forget who I am. Have your hands for that. And um what have I done oh. Oh, these lunatics are something else. Uh, nothing else better to do. <laughs> Knock it off, dude. Oh. Anyone help me? <sighs> so hold on. What you do with it? So I think what I'm gonna you know, understand, well, I'm gonna start doing to help my to help myself further is, of course, letting things go. It's the number one thing to help someone, and that's what I want to do. That's what I'm working towards. I want to grow. You're not supposed to be here. I want peace. Um. That was close. So, um, I just want to be seen as the good guy. I don't want to be seen as the bad guy anymore. Um, and I think because the way I was raised, I'm so caught on that. Because it's just so programmed in my brain and my mind that every time I look around, it's I'm constantly thinking about what people are saying about me. Because I've had situations happen on Twitch where I was called out for certain things that I shouldn't have done, like skipping runs and splitting things, and then I had to prove myself. And then I came out, and and then I was forgiven, and then I end up being a legit no damage runner later on, and. I, I think just because of that matter, because of the events that have corresponded in my life has made me feel insecure about myself at times. Um, this around people, I think it's just my insecurities. It's nothing to do with others. It's just, it's the events that have took place. Please, sir, I 
Right, let, me, uh, let me uh let me take these guys out. Money, What I'm gonna start I doing. That my husband is of your bravery. I've noticed that I focus too much on others than I do myself. That that's a that tends to be a problem of mine because I'm always trying to be more empathetic towards other people's problems, and I suck myself in and I get involved, and I think that's the issue. Like I've. I, I drown myself with all of these people's problems. I put the world on my shoulders because, like, I'm supposed to be this gospel messenger rapper who's had all this attraction, who's had people like David Goggins in my stories and the woman from Black Panther and, and all these big time celebrities that have seen my work, that have seen what I do, the real nihilists and people like that. And I, I put myself on this pedestal. Where it's like everyone is depending on me to not make a mistake. And I think my biggest problem, and I see it now, is I try to... Even even the people I care about, the people that tell me this, my girlfriend tells me this at times. I try to be in this perfect image. That's like a new damage run. It's like if I make a simple, if I make a mistake, I am so hard on myself. When I'm doing a run, I am so hard on myself. I am my hardest critic. And... That is so tough to deal with. And even when I'm around people, family, it, it gets worse. So, this is what I'm dealing with, man. It's, it's, it's a lot. It, it, it hurts. You know, to be seen in, in a bad, to be seen in a light that you know you, you want to be seen in a good light, not a bad light. And I just want um, people to know who's listening to this right now, because I know people are going to be listening to this when I post this on YouTube and set it on highlights. I just want peace, man. That's it. I want to be, I want to know that what I do is not, I never want to feel like I'm always too hard on myself. You know what I mean? And I feel like I get that because I've had that in the past. And um, it's been something, it's been tough. You know, it, it's it's one of those things that you have to adapt to. And you, you want to grow as an individual. You know what I mean? So that's, that's really like what I'm dealing with as far as demons and all that stuff. Like, trust me, it, <laughs> it's a pretty dark path that I'm dealing with right now, but, um, <sighs> some things are just too hard to explain. I just want peace. That's it. I just want peace, man. I want to feel like I felt months ago. There's a time. I can't remember exactly there's a time, but there was a moment in time in my life. I'm trying to still remember what I said. Because there was, there was a, 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 a routine that I stuck with. There was a routine that I stuck with. It was a, it was a method I had 
and it was like this this quote that I made for myself it was the most powerful quote and this helped other people I can't remember what I said but there was a time in one month I was the happiest person I had perfect happiness for a whole entire month I went straight I was happy every single day like that radar never dropped you know what I mean like when it comes to like runs and no damage runs and stuff like you have your health bar that can't drop for a run right you have perfect that's how my life was for a whole month and I'm I'm still going back to expertise and evaluate like what it was that I did to uh, to feel that way and I, I just I don't know I don't I don't I don't remember it was so long ago but I'm curious because you know, I'm, 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 you know I'm, I'm getting help and all that stuff. But trust me, man. Like it's been a long time since I've been like this, dude. Like if it wasn't for my streaming, if it wasn't for me being able to connect, to do the things that I love, with my passion, it it'd be really hard for me to cope with things. But luckily, I have my passion. I'm able to put my music out there and, you know, put into my lyrics and rap about what I'm going through emotionally. Like, an F. You know, I'm, I'm able to express myself and just, like, break down those barriers. Break down those walls, those shackles, those chains that are on my arms every single day. And... Um, Trust me, it's not fun feeling like that. Dude. It's never fun feeling alone. It's never fun feeling like a, you just have to be by yourself. And, and and then, like, you feel like you're your own best friend. Of course, like, yeah, you're your own best friend because it's you. You are your own person. But when someone loves you and someone cares for you... You have William to recognize of that sometimes the we're blind merchants with men loyal to by the things that are in front of us King Richard by more so than the things that are poorly crafted goods. These corrupt merchants must be removed. Find their stands and destroy them. Right, so I have to find some stands and destroy them. It looks like I'm going to be throwing some some guards into the uh, the guard stands here. We're just about done here for memory four. This is a long move, dude. Get out of the way. These freaking chicks are freaking annoying. Move. Okay, that did not go as planned. I totally screwed up because this stupid woman was a distraction. It was so annoying, dude. You know what I'm saying? Oh, that's a Templar, dude. That's a Templar. Oh, God. Oh, hold on. I gotta get over here. You like getting pushed, thrown, or tackled into the ground? Period. Alright, just give me a sec. I gotta get back to the merchant here, but I also gotta be safe. God dang it, dude. Just back off. Come on, come on. Dang it, dude. These people don't get off my ch Get off me, dude. I just need a safe spot here, dude. I don't care. Dang it. Dude, I got 45 seconds, and I have not even enough time to... Thank you. 
Now, how am I supposed to get back to him in time? I guess I gotta Bill, use the time. I gotta try to get back to him. I'll have your hand for that. Oh go. Wonder where he's up. Move. Dude, he's too far away. He's too far away. I wonder what he's up to. Great. Okay, I gotta take a different approach about this because I don't want to be uh detected especially on my no damage run Where's when I go going? for this run I I have to be stealthy move dude get out of the way move I will make you I don't have time to fight you dude I'm just trying to that was a very bad attempt there, buddy. You need to try a little bit better than that if you're going to try to catch up with me. Alright, looks like if I take the roof, I can, get, I can lose them. I'm taking the roof. The roof is the better option. I've learned that over time. Yay. There. Why did I do it the first time, right? Those are Templars. That's what they call them. So that's that's honestly like how I feel about everything and everybody. It it sucks, man. It's not a, it's not a good feeling. In general. I'm wasting time. I gotta stop messing around. There we go. There we go. Thank you for the help. That's what's supposed to be done. It may seem a small thing you've done today, but it's important nonetheless. So this yeah. The paper should prove that's, useful uh, when you finally face William. That's why I feel the way I feel right now. All right, now I gotta go back to the builder, or viewer. Uh, looks like they're blocking the way, so I gotta go up here now. So just everybody, all I ask is for your prayers. Just pray for me. You know, I I finally got it cross that I wear. Um, I've been waiting for one forever. You're you and, uh, Leave before you get now that I finally have one, you know, no, it, it makes me feel makes me feel better about myself to be able to have something to represent my respect for being a Christian. I'll have your hands for that. But, uh, Aside from that, that's what I'm doing more. Yeah, you're you crazy freaking. Alright, so the viewer is up here. So just pray for me, everybody. Dream Team, pray for me. Pray that things get better for me. Pray that this, these insecurities do leave at, at, at you know, over time. That I don't feel like I'm, I'm alone. That I don't feel like I'm being pushed away. You know, just just pray for me that I'll have your hands for that. But things will get better for me. 
I always want to feel that I am somebody important, and I know I'm somebody important, you know, I just, I need to recognize that, I need to convince myself of that, because at the end of the day, you are your own critic, and no one can say otherwise. I'm getting a lot more comfortable with this game. Just... Alright, viewer is right over here. I don't know, what type of question is that? What is that man thing? I really like the way I'm playing today. I'm playing so much Altair, better. what brings you back so soon? Oh. I've done as asked and armed myself with knowledge. Speak, and I will judge. William's host is large, and many men call him master. But he's not without enemies. He and King Richard do not see eye to eye. It's true, they've never been close. This works to my advantage. Richard's visit has upset him. Once the king has left, William will retreat into his fortress to brood. He'll be distracted. That's when I will strike. You're sure of this? As sure as I can be. And if things change, I'll adapt. Then I give you leave to go. End the life of Montferrat that we may call this city free. I'll return when the deed's been done. Fast forward in memory to a more recent one. So the assassination mission is coming up right now. He should stop acting. Go this direction. I wanted to see if I could start working on some kind of strategies for this game, just while I'm in the process of doing this because then it won't have to be so long for me to work on the game because then I could just start working on strategies tonight but I have to finish the playthrough I'll have your hands for that I never do a no damage run I'll have your hands for that I don't do a full playthrough I just don't do it because then you set yourself up for failure you dare steal in my presence that will cost you your life. So I think after I do this memory block for I'll be in a memory block five. Thank goodness. Come no further. That was cool. I'm really getting comfortable with the controls on this game now. After the fifth day, it's starting to just sink in. Muscle memory is starting to just bring me to a conclusion. No, I'm getting a lot of these flags. Why is he doing that? Take yourself from my sight. Here it is. Three thousand souls, William. I was told they would be held as prisoners and used to barter for the release of our men. The Saracens would not have honored that end of the bargain. You know this to be true. I did you a favor. <laughs> oh, yes. A great favor indeed. Now our enemies will be that much stronger in their convictions. Fight that much harder. I know our enemy well. 
They will not be emboldened, but filled with fear. Tell me, how is it you know the intentions of our enemies so well? You who forsake the field of battle to play at politics? I did what was right, what was just. You swore an oath to uphold the work of God, William. But that is not what I see here. No, I see a man who's trampled it. Your words are most unkind, my liege. I would hope I might have earned your trust by now. You are Arthur's regent, William, set to rule in my stead. How much more trust is required? Perhaps you'd like my crown. You missed the point. This is nothing new. Much as I'd like to waste my day trading words with you, I have a war to fight. We'll have to continue this another time. Do not let me delay you then, your grace. Truck. I fear there will be no place for men like him in the new world. Send word that I wish to speak with the troops. We must ensure that everyone is doing their part. Warn them that any negligence will be severely punished. I'm in no mood to be trifled with today. Yes, my lord. The rest of you, follow me. Leave before you get hurt. If this means missing meat, missing sleep, so be it. And should you fail in these tasks, you will learn the true meaning of discipline. Bring them forward. If I must make examples of some of you to ensure obedience, so be it. The two of you stand accused of whoring and drinking while on duty. What say you to these charges? My, 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 my lord, please. We, we, we meant no harm by it. We, we forgot ourselves. It will not happen again. No, it won't. Ah, ah, Rest now. Beautiful Your strategy. An end. What do you know of my work? I know that you are going to murder Richard and claim Akka for okay, your son so. Conrad. I like that. <laughs> for Conrad, my son is an arse. Unfit to lead his host. Bombs, to like I had on King Richard, the Oncino is no better. Blinded as he is by faith in the insubstantial, Akra does not belong to either of them. Then who? The city belongs to its people. How can you claim to speak for the citizens? You stole their food, disciplined them without mercy. 
Force them into service under you. Everything I did, I did to prepare them for the new world. Stole their food? No. I took possession so that when the lean times came, it might be rationed properly. <coughs> Look around. My district is without crime, save those committed by you and your ilk. And as for the conscription, they were not being trained to fight. They were being taught the merits of order and discipline. These things are hardly evil. No matter how noble you believe your intentions, these acts are cruel and cannot continue. <laughs> we'll see how sweet they are, the fruits of your labors. You do not free the cities as you believe, but rather damn them. And in the end, you'll have only yourself to blame. You, who speak of good intentions.
what a crazy ride there, man. What news? William of Montferrat is dead, and with him his plans for betrayal. You've done well keeping Akka from his hands. But why now, when the Crusaders require unity most? Could have waited. Waited for what? For Richard to return and discover his schemes? No. It was the perfect time for him to strike. Strange. I was sure he meant to take Akka for Conrad. Yet he claimed this was not his plan. You cannot trust the words of a snake, which even in death produces venom. I should discuss this with al -Wal. Yes, my friend. Make haste for Masia. I am sure he is eager for news. Memory block five, finally. Fast forwarding to oh. a more recent one. Man, this is a long game. Say, Doc. I'm ending the session. No, I'll be right there. You're sure about this? Yes. No. Everything's Denver. I don't see how he could. Of course. I understand. You're in a lot of trouble, Mr. Miles. What's his problem? They're coming for you. Who's coming for me? Assassins. Hey, I had nothing to do with this. Sounds like they're mounting some kind of rescue attempt. Guess you're more important than you realized. Man, things just keep getting weirder and weirder around here. It was bound to happen. What do you mean? That little fight your ancestor started during the Third Crusade? It never ended. You're being held by Templars. Vidix a Templar? There's no way you could have known. They hide it so well. But to answer your question, Vidic works for them. We all do. Abstergo is their company. I thought Templars were old dudes with funny hats who sat around drinking beer and plotting world domination with, like, the lizard people. No. Except the part about world domination, I guess. Look, Desmond, it's complicated. Half the stuff they say about the Templars comes from crazy tinfoil hat-wearing nutjobs. The other half is misinformation intentionally produced by the Templars themselves. But they are the bad guys, right? If there's one thing I've learned since I started working here, it's that there's no such thing. It's all so relative. I guess the best way to explain it is, what they want is good. But the way they're going about it, it's bad. Really bad. What are they trying to do? Lucy. Yes. Miss Stillman, I need to speak with you. Get up here, now! On my way, Doctor. I'm sorry, Desmond, I have to go. You should turn in for the night. The answers to all of your questions are right in front of you. You just have to know where to look. Be the end of memory four. Then we're gonna be in memory block five. Missed you this morning, Doc. Get in the animus. works select the memory on the menu in front of you and let's begin this dog is not nice man he is a jerk use the action view to gather information about your surroundings come in Altair. i trust you're well rested ready for your remaining trials i am but i'd speak with you first I have questions. Ask them. 
I'll do my best to answer. The merchant king of Damas murdered the nobles who ruled his city. Mejdeddin in Jerusalem used fear to force his people into submission. I suspect William meant to murder Richard and hold Akka with his troops. These men were meant to aid their leaders. Instead, they chose to betray them. What I do not understand is why. Is the answer not obvious? The Templars desire control. Each man, as you've noted, wanted to claim their cities in the Templar name, that the Templars themselves might rule the Holy Land and eventually beyond. But they cannot succeed in their mission. Why is that? Their plans depend upon the Templar treasure, the Peace of Eden. But we hold it now, and they cannot hope to achieve their goals without it. What is this treasure? It is temptation. It's just a piece of silver. Look at it. What am I supposed to see? This piece of silver cast out Adam and Eve. It turned staves into snakes, parted and closed the Red Sea. Eris used it to start the Trojan War, and with it a poor carpenter turned water into wine. It seems rather plain for all the power you claim it has. How does it work? He who holds it commands the hearts and minds of whoever looks upon it. Whoever tastes of it, as they say. Then Gagne's men? An experiment. Herbs used to simulate its effects, to be ready for when they held it. Talel supplied them. Tamir equipped them. They were preparing for something. But what? War. And the others, the men who ruled the cities, they meant to gather up their people. Make them like Gagne's men. The perfect citizens. The perfect soldiers. A perfect world. Robert de Sable must never have this back. So long as he and his brothers live, they will try. Then they must be destroyed. Which is what I've had you doing. There are two more Templars who require your attention. One in Akka, known as Sibran. One in Damas, called Jubair. Visit with the Bureau leaders. They'll instruct you further. As you wish. Be quick about it. No doubt Robert de Sable is made nervous by our continued success. His remaining followers will do their best to expose you. They know you come, the man in the White Hood. They'll be looking for you. They won't find me. I'm but a blade in the crowd. Here, my gift to you, in gratitude for the good work you've done. break. It seems my students do not fully understand what it is to wield a blade. Perhaps you could show them what you know.
must be busy. I understand. I understand, defense break. Perfect. Oh, okay. The work of a master. And that, my students, is how we all should fight. I'm trying to figure out how to do it. No, I don't get it. You must be busy. I understand. Memory block five. Finally, so after the block, it looks like there's two of them for this memory block. So if I do two of them, I'll get to memory block six. I want to try to just stretch and try to push to get to memory block six. But then again, it's 10 o'clock. And I don't want to be on here till it's freaking like 1 o'clock in the morning. So... We got some progress. We're on memory block five. We'll leave it at that. Next time I come back on here, I'll try to go straight to memory block six. But there is some strategies and stuff that I had picked up along the along the way. Um, it looked like uh, definitely some. Uh, there's some angles I can go across. And, um, I'm gonna end it here. Hopefully, I've clarified things a little bit better, um, explaining a little bit more on my situation and why I've been dealing with Sit down, uh, the problems I have. So, we're gonna end it there. Thank you for watching. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. I know as well as the commentary, it was a little intense, but I'm just letting you know what I'm dealing with. It's not easy, man. Not easy at all. But, um... But that's pretty much it for me. Um, done. Uh, I'm glad that I was able to come on here, stream a bit, and uh, leave things where they are. So that's my schedule. Uh, don't pay attention to this one. It's this one. But I have to add it. I have to fix it. But this is my schedule right here. Okay. Saturday off, Sunday off, Friday, I, I could stream depending on it and uh, Thursday I'm off like that's just my schedule right now until things change for the notice but that's where I'm at 
Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I played a little bit better today. And uh, we'll get through this because... Oh, I have a lot of stamina to do this full run all in one go. It's a five, six hour run. Anyway, remember if you're doing a no damage run, take it seriously. Don't mess around. With enough time and patience and focus, you will succeed. I am the P2 Pro. Please follow my Reddit, YouTube, Twitter if there's any questions game interviews or anything like that that people are interested in and with me just hit me up let me know um i've done a variety of no damage runs i have about 25 in my belt <laughs> so um got a lot of experience but um this one is quite challenging let me say anyway take care i love you guys and peace